Hi, I'm Mark. This is Mark's Tech Vlogs on YouTube, and I'm going to bring you a very quick tutorial today on how to use the ECG feature on the Apple Watch. Now, last night, Apple released WatchOS 5.2, which means the ECG feature, which up until now has only been available in the States, is now available in other parts of the world, including the UK. And so this is a quick tutorial video on how to take an ECG using your Apple Watch Series 4. Now the first step is to go and check that you've got the right version of watchOS running. This will be 5.2 or above. So what you need to do is go into the Watch app on your phone and then go into Software Update and just check that there's no updates available and that the version is 5.2 or above. You'll only need to do this once. Secondly, go onto your watch and you'll find a brand new app called ECG. Tap into this and if it's the first time you're using it, it will prompt you to open the health app on your phone. On the health app on your phone, you'll simply put in your date of birth and it will tell you a few things about the ECG feature and you'll be ready to go. Next, you go back to the ECG app on your phone and it will talk you through the process of taking an ECG. This basically involves keeping your finger on the crown and making sure the watch strap is nice and tight for about 30 seconds. You'll then be able to see the results on your watch or dive into your phone to view previous results, export them and find out more about what some of the stats in there mean. And that's it. It's great to see the ECG feature finally arrived in the UK. Typically it arrives just after I've scheduled a couple of Apple Watch Series 4 reviews to come up on this channel where I say it isn't available, um, but I'll amend the comments on those when they come out. I hope you guys have found this video helpful. Please subscribe to this channel. If you've got any questions, stick them below and I'll see you again soon.